When was the last time you were able to put your phone away for four to six hours and complete a task at hand? It's probably been a while, hasn't it? Listen, you are wasting your potential. You know, once you scroll on your phone for five minutes, those are five minutes of your life that you will never get back. And the average person wastes four and a half hours every single day just on their phone. Now, by assuming you sleep eight hours a day means they'll waste 25% of their life. And that's your competition, by the way, which is good news for you because with just a little bit of discipline, you can get ahead of 99% of people. And before we even start, you need to know that your ability to control your mind, emotions, and urges is directly correlated to your level of success or lack thereof. That's why it's so important for you to master your own mind. And if you keep watching this video all the way through, I'll show you exactly how you can master your mind to make your success inevitable. And all of this starts with a dopamine detox. Now, for those of you who don't know what dopamine is, it's the part in our bodies responsible most for giving us pleasure. You see it in sex, shopping, and even eating. And I'm going to give you five steps from easiest to hardest that if you're able to master over the next 30 days will drastically change your life forever. Now, the first step to our dopamine detox is using a screen time limiting app. Knowing that you waste 25% of your life on your phone should be enough of a wake up call. Using a screen time limiting app will allow you to block out certain hours and certain apps throughout the day to make sure that you are not even tempted to use one of those apps that continue to distract you and lessen your productivity. Now, the second non-negotiable in our dopamine detox is to stop Stop smoking, drinking, and eating processed foods. Mind-altering substances give us false senses of reality, and it doesn't just stop there. When I say stop smoking and drinking, I mean stop drinking anything that is not water, and I mean stop smoking anything, even nicotine, cigars, hookahs, I don't care what it is. These things are simply taking away from you being able to perform at the highest level and live life at the purest form getting in the habit of eating clean foods. You guys have to think of your body as a temple. Everything that we put into ourselves directly correlates to how we will perform. You put in shitty foods in your body, you're gonna find a shitty performance from yourself. You put clean foods in your body, you'll see clean results being taken. For example, I use a water distiller every single day. And at the end of each fill, you're able to see the leftover residue that's inside the can. And it is disgusting to see the type of water that I used to drink and that 99% of this world drinks, especially considering that the majority of our bodies are water, we have to be putting in the cleanest liquids and foods in our bodies to be performing at the highest level. Overall, this is gonna eliminate brain fog, allow you to perform better, allow you to sleep better, and overall boost all of your lifestyle habits as these are healthy habits. Now the third non-negotiable on our dopamine detox is exercising at least one time a day. Now I don't mean that you have to go slam your body in the gym and do all of this crazy stuff, but I mean at least going on a walk every single day. There's simply something about being in God's creation and walking around in nature, and at least for myself, allows me to think of my most creative and best ideas. Now, another extension to this non-negotiable is I want you guys to perform your exercise early in the day. When you exercise early in the day, you have performed the most straining task on your body, which then allows everything else throughout your day to feel so much easier because you've already knocked out the hardest point, and this will create a drastic boost in your productivity. Now, the second hardest non-negotiable that we we have but we must stick to is stop watching corn. Corn is something that is corrupting the minds of everyone nowadays. Watching corn leads to hyper stimulating triggers that cause our dopamine levels to be off the charts. And the worst part is you're literally blowing loads into nothing. You're watching someone on your phone or your computer perform sexual acts and you are getting aroused to the idea of somebody else performing the task while you're sitting there on your phone in your bedroom. And if you think about it, this is the biggest act of a loser. I mean, really just dial in the idea of what you are doing. There's a reason why you never end up feeling good once you are finished. So seriously, get off the phone and get in the real world. Stop fantasizing over some girl who could give less of a fuck about you as you watch her on your phone and get in the real world and boost your actual lives. And honestly, if you can't quit this one, there is no shot you ever have at becoming successful. Now, the last one, which I believe is the hardest one to perform, is to read 10 pages a day. Now, I know you're thinking, wait, it's harder to read 10 pages a day than it is to stop watching corn? Well, yeah, it actually is because people are lazy. Every single time somebody picks up a book, you're gonna see them read one page, get a text message, or get reminded of something, and start to scroll through TikTok and waste their lives on their phones. But guess what? That's good news for you because that is your competition. Now listen, there gets a point in life where you start to enter rooms 
where nobody is impressed with what watch you have, with how much money you have, but they actually are impressed with what you know. Remember guys, knowledge is power. And to become a more powerful individual, you must become a more knowledgeable individual. And a great way to do this is by reading 10 pages a day. With all of that being said, I hope you realize that no matter how much money you're making right now, the most valuable asset you have is your time. And you need to know how to leverage it as best as you can. You need to put your time and energy into making sure that you level up your own character, making sure that you're building a better future for you and your loved ones. So what I want you guys to do is go down to the comments and type out your tasks and goals for tomorrow. And I'll reply to every single comment and give you my own thoughts. Also, one of the best ways to have a better future is by making sure that you are becoming financially independent. And the way most people do it is by becoming an entrepreneur, specifically for me, becoming a trader. And if you'd like to get started on that, I've linked a private video in the description that goes over how you can make seven to $10,000 a month and replace your income. Trading saved my life and it saved over 2,000 of my students' lives. So it may be your one decision away from your success. Go check it out in the description. It's a super short video and it gives away all the secrets that made me a millionaire by 21. I hope you enjoyed and if you did, please leave a like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.